I was for 12 years the, uh, the editor of a scientific journal called Icarus. It's the uh, leading professional journal of uh, studies of, of planets, of the solar system. Icarus was uh, the guy who uh, uh, flew his uh, wax and feather wings too high up, too close to the sun in the Greek myth. The wax melted and he fell into the sea and drowned. He failed. He didn't escape from Crete. Uh, to the Greek mainland, he died. Why name a, uh, a journal after him? Why not name it after his father, Daedalus, who, uh, who got away and moreover was the guy who, uh, who uh, invented these, these funny wings in the first place? The reason is, as is stated on the masthead of the journal, that uh, Icarus demonstrates the limits of our understanding. Icarus pushes our knowledge to the breaking point. And that's what science is about. Not the comfortable understanding of things that are in place and well understood, but pushing the boundaries of science to what we don't yet understand. And of course we're going to fail sometimes when we do that. We're only human. But it is there at the frontiers that we ought to be.